A foundry is a place or factory where the production of casting is produced by the use of melted metal poured into a mold to solidify and produce a new shape. Foundry work is a process whereby casting is produced. In the engineering world, foundry work is highly specialized and recommended. It embraces many skills, including those of molders, pattern makers, furnace men, metallurgists, and core makers. Foundries make much more than only the metal components used in pipes, railroads, and engines. They also serve as parts for the machinery needed to produce many of the basic consumer goods we rely on. Metal castings are used in 90% of all produced goods. Demand for complicated and high-quality products has increased in tandem with a growth in industrial demands and applications. Fortunately, there are many casting methods that can create intricate and precise products for a range of uses and customer requirements. Well, in this article, I'll be discussing foundry work as the meaning, diagram, types, and precautions will be discussed. A quick reminder for you to subscribe if you are yet to do that. So let's begin. What is foundry work? Millions of tons of scrap metal are melted and recast each year at foundries as part of the manufacturing recycling effort to produce new durable goods. Sand is also utilized by many foundries in the molding process. Sand is frequently used, restored, and reused in these foundries, which is another type of recycling. A foundry is a type of factory where metal castings are made. Metals are shaped by being melted into a liquid, poured into a mold, and then having the mold material removed once the metal has set and cooled. The two most frequently treated metals are cast iron and aluminum. However, foundries also use other metals including bronze, brass, steel, magnesium, and zinc to make castings. Parts of the desired sizes and forms can be created with this procedure. By pouring molten metal into a mold, foundry work is the process of creating a metal casting of an object. The foundry sector is frequently thought of as the place where gold is melted and formed into bars or bullion. What are the safety precautions to be considered in a foundry shop? Safety in foundries is considered by skilled foundry workers with excellent situational awareness, strength, and endurance because foundry is such dangerous and uncomfortable work for a human. Foundry work is very hazardous due to its working process, which involves the melting of metal at a very high temperature of 2600 degrees Fahrenheit, 1425 degrees Celsius, and the unpredictable nature of chemical reactions at extreme temperatures. A steam explosion is very common if a proper cooling process is not involved. Loading metal in a charged furnace for melting is considered one of the most dangerous operations in the foundry. The loading should be done by experts who have developed the necessary skills and understanding of metals and their properties, their melting temperatures, and safe work procedures. A single mistake can lead to the destruction of equipment and cause injury to the workers. Foundries are hot and sweaty places to work. Workers are expected to wear hard hats, eye protection, face shields, thick aluminized clothing, etc. Foundries are designed with high roofs to allow fresh air to circulate. The reaction of dropping melted metal and concrete floors can lead to cracks, so the foundry floors should be constructed of non-reactive or flame-radiant materials. That is all for now. The foundry has been explained. Please subscribe and share with others.